Hello and welcome back to Quilts by Carmel. I am Joe Carmel and I am super excited because I am off for the 4th of July weekend and I am going to spend that time making quilts. What better way to spend my time off, right? No, I'm just joking, but I want to do it making quilt tops, okay? And I want to show you my first one. It's already done. It's the Jelly Sticks pattern by Corey Yoder. And I made it in this beautiful American Dream fabric by Riley Blake. Um, I got this at T Quilts Retreat when we went to Missouri Star Quilt Company uh, 2022. So that was June of last year. And I finally did. It was a, a two and a half roll up. And I just love how it turned out. I'm going to show you a close up. I got this background um, fabric and it looks like little fire fireworks to me and it's from Riley Blake it's not out of this line but I love it and I just want to show it to you okay guys okay I'm gonna lift you up you're moving you're moving you're moving let me see if I can show it to you doesn't that look like little fireworks I think it does <laughs> but it turned out really cute and I love the border I put this one and a half inch um, red border in and that looks like fireworks too let me see if i can find it for y'all here it is up here that's that and then i have this as my four and a half inch border so it looks really cute i think anyway i'm gonna sit it down now Let's see if i can do it hopefully not without too much too much disruption <laughs> So that's my first quote. I'm gonna make a couple others. I have a couple other ideals. Let me just show you. I want to do um, this quilt. It's called the Echo Star Log Cabin. Um, Miss, Misty Doan did it on Missouri Star Quilt Company, but I want. she did it in black and white. I wanna change it to red, white, and blue. So I wanna make the star uh, blue the background white and then the outer so outside red so that's my ideal and i've already done the the calculations uh, and when i say calculations i want to um ex i'll give you an example of the star i need four one two three four log cabin solid blue and then two four six eight that are half blue and half white so I just needed to do the calculations to make sure I had enough fabric. Uh, and I'm gonna use up my pre-cuts because I am trying to decrease and de de stash or however you wanna put it, your my pre-cuts. So I am using my um, American Dream Fat 8. I know it's not enough to do it alone. So I'm gonna use this jelly roll or, is this a jelly roll? Yeah, it's Moda, it's a jelly roll of Red, red Gatherings. I think that's what this called yeah that looks like Lisa Bonjean <laughs> so red gatherings and then I still may need a little more red so I have this um, this is called American American Valor so I'm probably gonna pull some reds out of it as well okay and it has Navy in the back too so these are fat quarters so I should have more than enough to do my echo star log cabin quilt in red white and blue <laughs> okay okay guys i am back happy independence day happy fourth of july it's actually fourth of july right now and i am finishing up my echo star log cabin quilt and the pattern is by misty doan of missouri star quilt company it was super fun let me just go over uh before i lay it out let me go over how many blocks of each colors that i needed because I was doing red, white, and blue, or blue, white, and red. <laughs> it sounds better when you said red, white, and blue. So my center star, I needed four solid blue. So here's my one, two, three, four. There's my four solid blue log cabin blocks. And then I needed eight of the uh, half blue, half uh, low volume. Then I needed, I believe it's 12 of the low volume and then 16 of the half red half low volume and 24 of the red solid red blocks all right so i am going to 
put this together, okay? Ready, set, go. Come on, man. all right i am almost done all i have to do is sew my blocks together but first i want to square them up to make sure they're all the same size because it will be so much easier if they're all the same size um, to make sure that the, the quilt comes out square so i am excited about that they should be 10 and a half at the largest and 10 and a quarter at the smallest so i just gotta find out what the smallest block is and then I can um, square them all up to that size, all right? And then sew this quilt together. 
I am loving how this is turning out. I'm so happy that I got to use up those pre-cuts though. I am super excited about that. I think I said American Dream, but it's actually, uh, it was the Fat Eight was American Gatherings by Lisa Von Jean. And oh, I love how this is the darker blue and the darker red and it's coming out fantastic. I also use that jelly roll of Red and White Gatherings by Lisa Von Jean. And then a couple fat quarters. So I used up all of those and I am happy about that. That was a good de-stasher for me. I used three different um, pre-cuts in this quilt and I did not go to the store and I am super proud of myself for that because it was so tempting to just to go get some more red or get some blue, but I have plenty of blue in the fat eight. I have a couple strips left over so I can make a couple of pillows too, okay? So this is it. This is my red, white, and blue Echo Star Log Cabin Quilt. The pattern is by Misty Doan of Missouri Star Quilt Company. All right, I will see you guys later. If you would, please like, comment, and, or subscribe. What did you guys do today? What did, how did you celebrate it? Fourth of July. I spent it quilting and I had a ball. I just loved hanging out in my sewing room. I just had such a fantastic day, had the day off and it was fantastic. I hope you guys had a fantastic fourth as well. Good night and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.